we found a really cool way to enjoy the freshest flavours of the Aussie bush. Chocolate, vanilla, strawberry. How about lily pilly? Desert lime? What about wattle seed? What? It doesn't sound like your typical ice cream flavours. Well, that's exactly the point. When it comes to flavours, ice cream makers Sandra and Ian have really been thinking outside the box, looking to the Aussie bush for inspiration. Ian, I've tried bush tucker, but never like this. Yeah, the flavours of Australia are fantastic, quite unique. We got the idea of making it into ice cream when we went to the Daintree, where a a farmer was making homemade ice cream and mixing mangoes and fruit, exotic fruit like that in it. And I thought we could do that with bush foods. The kids love our Mallee honey and the native mint and cocoa. They're probably the two favourites. Gathering all of these natural ingredients must be a bit of a tough gig. I mean, it is bush tucker. So do you have to do a lot of bushwalking, Ian? We used to go through the bush looking for ingredients, but these days we get them from growers or from wild pickers. For example, we've got a group of Aboriginals up near Broome who uh, supply us with kakadu plum. It's really important when picking native fruit that you know what you're doing because many of them are toxic if you don't know exactly what you're getting. Once the bush tucker has arrived, it doesn't get stored as is. It gets turned into syrup, like this wattle seed, for example. These are our wattle seeds. We then take them and roast them in a hot oven, just like you're making coffee beans. And then we grind them up, very fine grind, and then we espresso them. We actually put the grounds in with the coffee and we dump that into the ice cream, and that's our flavour mix for making wattle seed ice cream. These syrups can be preserved in the fridge to be used at a later date. But no need for that today, because it's going into the mixer straight away, along with milk, cream and sugars. This is the best part. We're going to make the ice cream now. The machine has three parts. The outer tub, an inner tub, and this thing in the middle, a dasher, which beats the mixture as it freezes. Ice and salt cool the whole thing down to a chilly minus 12 degrees Celsius. The taste of the Aussie bush freshly frozen. <laughs> How would you like that? In a cup or a cone? 